The early 80s was a successful time for the Welsh media industry and there was an increasing demand for expansion. A new purpose-built studio was constructed at Culver House Cross on the outskirts of Cardiff. The advent of S4C meant, meant huge expansion for HTV because we were producing so many programmes in Welsh for the new channel. The centre was developed, the new television centre, the most modern in Europe in its day, in its time, built to the cost of 10 million, which was a lot of money in those days, and is still a lot of money, and um, five million pounds to equip in equipment. But as HTV was expanding, heavy industry in Wales was in crisis. In 1983, Lewis Merthyr staged a successful strike to save their pit. We're very proud of the men who stayed in. We are very, very grateful to the people who provided us. And we're very thankful to all the fine people who supported us in all our other pits. While the miners of South Wales were fighting for their livelihoods, new media industries were blossoming. In 1984, HTV's new studios were opened by the Prince and Princess of Wales. Well, if I don't, then nobody will get to the right place. <laughs> Culver House Cross was a state-of-the-art building that included the largest television studio in Europe. The first programme made was called Success. It showcased HTV's new premises. HTV Wales was making a huge range of programmes, from drama to music programmes to all sorts of a really high-class, high-quality um, entertainment. And I think that HTV had a very, very special place in the Welsh public's mind.